Welcome to the RTO Superhero Podcast with me, Angela Connell Richards, where we will explore the complexities of compliance and how to ensure business success within your RTO. This podcast is for anyone within the training industry who wants to learn from my experience as an RTO consultant, RTO manager, trainer and assessor, and entrepreneur, as well as the experience of other experts in this field. Listen in and let us help you become the RTO superhero you want to be. Welcome to the RTO Superhero Podcast with me, Angela Connell Richards. Today we'll be diving into the fascinating world of educational technology or edtech and its impact on the vocational education and training sector. Our focus will be on the unique challenges and benefits of integrating virtual reality, learning management systems and online assessments into VET programs. As VET professionals, it's essential to stay updated on the latest trends and strategies to ensure our learners receive the best education possible. In this episode, we'll explore the best practices for engaging students and trainers in using technology effectively. Discuss emerging trends in EdTech for VET, such as artificial intelligence, personalised learning and gamification, and provide specific examples of successful ed tech solutions that have been implemented in RTOs. So let's dive in. Engaging students and trainers in using technology effectively. To kick things off, let's talk about best practices for engaging students and trainers in using technology effectively. As we incorporate more ed tech into VET programs, it's crucial to ensure that all stakeholders understand and embrace the new tools at their disposal. One way to do this is by providing comprehensive training in both students and trainers. Consider offering workshops, webinars, or even one-on-one coaching sessions to help everyone adapt to new technologies. It's also essential to have ongoing support available such as dedicated help desk or online resources like tutorials and FAQs. Another effective strategy is to involve students and trainers in the decision-making process when selecting new ed tech solutions. Encourage feedback and input from all parties to ensure the chosen tools meet the needs and preferences of everyone. By giving everyone a voice in the decision-making process, you can help create a sense of ownership and buy-in, leading to greater engagement and success with new technology. Emerging trends in EdTech for VET. Now that we've discussed the importance of engagement, let's dive into some of the emerging trends in EdTech for VET. As technology continues to advance, we're seeing some exciting developments that have the potential to reshape the landscape of vocational education and training. Let's begin with artificial intelligence, or AI. AI is becoming increasingly increasingly prevalent in the ed tech space, offering a range of benefits for VET programs. For example, AI-powered analytics can help trainers identify gaps in students' knowledge and provide tailored feedback and support. Furthermore, AI-driven virtual assistants can assist with administrative tasks, freeing up time for trainers to focus on providing quality training. Personalised learning. Another significant trend is personalised learning which uses data-driven insights to create customised learning experiences tailored to each student's unique needs, preferences and goals. By leveraging technologies like adaptive learning platforms, trainers can provide individualised support to help students progress at their own pace and achieve better outcomes. Gamification. Gamification is another exciting trend in the world of edtech as it can help make learning more engaging and enjoyable for students. By incorporating game elements like points, badges and leadership boards into the learning experience, trainers can encourage healthy competition and motivate students to stay engaged and perform at their best. 
Examples of successful edtech solutions in RTOs. With these trends in mind, let's discuss some specific examples of successful edtech solutions that have been implemented into RTOs and how they have benefited both the students and the trainers. Learning Management System An LMS is a powerful tool for managing and delivering training content, tracking student data and facilitating communication between students and trainers. RTOs have found success in implementing LMS platforms such as Canvas, Moodle and Blackboard to streamline course administration, enhance collaboration and provide a centralised location for resources and assessments. By adapting an LMS, trainers can spend less time on administrative tasks and more time providing personalised support to their students. Virtual reality and augmented reality. VR and AR technologies have made significant strides in recent years and are now being utilised in various VET programs. These immersive technologies can provide students with realistic, hands-on training experiences that are difficult or impossible to replicate in traditional classroom setting. For example, RTOs offering Automotive repair or construction courses can use VR simulations to give students the opportunity to practice their skills in a safe environment. Ensuring that it's controlled environment before working on life, uh, real life projects. This not only enhances the learner's experience, but also reduces the risk of accidents and injuries. Online assessments. Online assessments have become increasingly popular in VET programs as they offer a more flexible and efficient way to evaluate student performance. By using tools like quizzes, surveys and interactive simulations, trainers can gather valuable data on students' progress, identify areas for improvement and provide personalised feedback. Moreover, online assessments can reduce the workload associated with grading and marking, allowing trainers to focus on delivering high-quality instruction and support. Personalised learning. As mentioned earlier, personalised learning is a growing trend in edtech that has the potential to revolutionise the VET sector. RTOs have begun implementing tools like adaptive learning platforms and AI-driven analytics to create customised learning experiences for their students. By analysing data on students' performance, learning styles and preferences, these tools can help trainers develop tailored lesson plans and support strategies with, that, with, that cater to each individual's unique needs. In turn, this can lead to improved student engagement, retention and overall success. In conclusion, the integration of edtech solutions like virtual reality, learning management systems and online assessments into the VET programs offers numerous benefits for both students and trainers. By staying up to date on emerging trends and best practices, RTOs can effectively engage their stakeholders in using technology and create more dynamic, personalised learning experiences. To overcome the challenges of implementing these new technology, it's crucial to provide comprehensive training and support, involve students and trainers in the decision-making process, and continually evaluate the effectiveness of the chosen solutions. By doing so, RTOs can ensure that they are harnessing the full potential of edtech and paving the way for a brighter future in vocational education and training. Thank you for joining me today in this episode of the RTO Superhero Podcast. I hope you've gained some valuable insights and actionable strategies to help you enhance your VET programs with EdTech. Stay tuned for more exciting episodes and until next time, keep learning and growing as an RTO superhero. Thank you for joining us at the RTO Superhero Podcast with me, Angela Connell-Richards. Please take a moment to rate and review the podcast on your preferred podcast app. 
Each rating and review helps me fulfil my goal of helping training organisations around Australia to learn and grow in compliance and business success.